Bow Wow Wedding Vows is the seventh episode of the eighth season of Rugrats and I didn't mind it, it was okay, but I didn't think it needed to be a double parter. This is set around Easter. Chaz and Kira are planning an Easter brunch. We have a lot of Easter images and bunnies and I think visually that worked quite well. We also have the main narrative, which involves Spike spending more time with Fifi than with Tommy. And Tommy's obviously very devastated. He tries to put on a brave face. He gives a very gummy smile at one point as he tries to smile through the pain. He goes to Dill in the middle of the night for advice and Dill's response to it was just absolutely adorable. Uh, Dill was a, a really good source of some brief humour. Uh, and Tommy doesn't understand why his best friend Spike would now rather spend time with Fifi than with him. And I don't want to say what happens. I will with a spoiler warning just in case you haven't seen it or can't remember. I'll discuss what actually happens in a moment but it was it was sweet it was nice it was a fun story I think it was heartfelt and if you've ever been a pet owner um I think you'll be able to relate to it particularly if you're a pet owner and your pet has shown favoritism for somebody else at any point I don't like other people being in my house because I get jealous of the attention my cat gives to them and I, I completely understand Tommy's anxieties and and what it must have felt like but not much happens. There is the wedding, the wedding between uh, Spike and Fifi, but it's not the first time the babies have had a pretend wedding, so all of the jokes surrounding that were kind of recycled and not very interesting. So it, it was fine, it was a nice enough episode, but I think we could have taken out a lot and condensed it down to one segment and it might have been a bit more enjoyable. So it's fine. There were some good bits, such as the bit with Dill. I wouldn't want to lose that bit. I rather enjoyed Dill's reaction uh, when he said night night to Tommy. Uh, very, very cute. So at the end of the episode, this is of course a spoiler for something that happens. At the end, we learn why Spike has been with Fifi. And it turns out that Fifi was actually expecting puppies. We have these adorable Spike Fifi hybrid puppies and honestly we don't actually get to see them up close. We don't get a proper look at the puppies but what we see is quite cute. I'm hoping they're involved in some more stories but at the same time I hope they don't do what the show seems to do whenever there's a new character and just make it all about that character all of the time. Oddly they didn't do that with Susie. When they introduced Susie they kind of forgot about her for a little bit but obviously with Chucky and Kimmy and Tommy and Dill it just became all about that so I hope the next episodes aren't just about the puppies but they are really really sweet and I'd like to see see them more up close so it's not a bad episode probably some bad parenting from Chaz and Kira's perspective if they didn't even realize Fifi was expecting puppies but that aside I found it to be really sweet could have been just one segment rather than a double feature but either way, I thought it was pretty sweet and entertaining and I like the Easter theme as well. It made a lot of sense. Not a personal favourite, but I still quite liked it.